Anthony Padovano is one of the foremost sculptors. His work has been seen by millions of people in exhibitions, collections, and public places around the world. In over 50 years of sculpting, he has made a number of styles his own. He is a classical sculptor who carves figures out of stone that express feelings about scenes from life or stories from mythology. He is also an abstract sculptor who expresses his feelings and ideas by carving them out of stone or building them in metal. Anthony Padovano began sculpting when he was 12 years old. He was still a teenager when he started working for a monument company. Here, he perfected his technique of classical figurative sculpting. While he was a student at Columbia University, he became influenced by the modern sculptures of artists like Picasso and Henry Moore. Over the years, Padovano's work has been highly acclaimed and he has won many prestigious awards, including the Prix de Rome, and a Guggenheim Fellowship. While maintaining his studio, Padovano was also sharing his knowledge as a teacher at a number of leading schools. He is the author of a comprehensive guide to the techniques and materials of every type of sculpture. Padovano's had 16 solo shows and his work is in the collection of the Whitney Museum and other museums. In one review, Hilton Kramer of the New York Times wrote, Anthony Padovano is the real thing, a sculptor with a wonderfully natural gift for the forms and methods and syntax of modern sculpture. Padovano has been awarded commissions for a number of monumental works. While well received, some of the works were the object of some controversy. Others were more traditional. Padovano's sculptures can be seen in exhibits and installations around the country. A reviewer in the New York Times said, Padovano's sculpture have fairly large aspirations. It is sculpture that addresses itself to the public, yet it brings to the ambition a lyrical bent. A reviewer in Art Times said, Padovano playfully challenges our contemporary complacency. His work does the unexpected, the unpredictable. Although it is modern sculpture, there is a hint of the Renaissance at times in his stone carvings. The Padovano studio is always busy, with Padovano and his assistants working on a number of sculptures at a time. Though much of his work looks spontaneous and free-form, he develops and perfects his ideas by first making models.
Padovano is always sketching and begins his projects with drawings. From these, he selects some to continue to make into sculptures. The circle and sphere are shapes that Padovano has worked with time and again. The symmetry and balance are the starting points from which he creates an explosive energy. Putting together sculptures from pieces of metal is another one of Padovano's techniques. Whether creating from found objects, carving figures out of marble, or making monuments out of metal, Padovano's work stands out for its originality, strength, and beauty.